Welcome back to the Morning Blend. A lot of people think that Easter is the perfect holiday to give someone you love a rabbit. And I agree because they're adorable, <laughs> they're soft, they're super cute. But a, cat, a pet can be a lot of work and mm -hmm. sometimes caring for rabbits becomes too much. So what happens to all of those bunnies after Easter? Yeah, Sharon Miller is the chapter manager of the Wisconsin House of Rabbit Society. And she's here with more on bunny basics and what it takes to truly care for these sweet little furry pets. Good to see you. Hello. Good to see you again. Yeah, so um, Easter, a lot of people do get bunnies as yes, gifts. Unfortunately, um, some pet stores sell them and they're tiny, cute little, you know, how can you re resist? Yeah. And people sometimes impulsively do them. And if you don't do your research, there can be a lot of problems. Okay, so <coughs> let's talk about the reality. What is mm -hmm. it really like to have a rabbit? What are some of the things that people are maybe surprised to learn after they bring the, the cute bunny home? Right. Well, the first thing they learn is once they hit, um, when you get rabbits and they're really, they're only a few months old, they're easily handled, um, but as they start maturing and once they hit sexual maturity around six, seven months old, things change big time. Oh, okay. And their behaviors, they start demonstrating a lot of um, not such pleasant behaviors. Um, mm -hmm. which is why they need to be spayed and neutered. And oh, a lot of people oh, don't oh. take that in consideration. And it's expensive to do that. So um, that's oftentimes when the rabbits end up being gotten rid of, either let go, sometimes people will let them go. Oh, um, oh in the they, wild? Oh. Yeah. Don't do that, don't do that right? Yes. right? You're right, they're domestic, they can't, they're yeah. not wild, they don't, they don't know, know how to, to survive do. and they stand out because they're gonna they're get hurt. Colored. Yeah, but look at Remy cleaning his face. Sorry, yeah. that's what he's doing. It's really cute. Is it she, right? She? Yes. She. Okay. She's cleaning yeah. her face. We want to be gender appropriate. Yep. Oh. Um, yes. Washing her face. <laughs> <laughs> um, so she's reached her sexual maturity. We should refer to her. As oh, she's face. already been spayed. So okay, she's good. So not she's not going to go through that. So right. do you do you avoid a lot of those yes. beha unwanted or, or difficult behaviors if they have been spayed or yes. neutered? Okay. Yes. She, she's a young rabbit as well. She's only about eight months old or so. We're not exactly sure. But when she first came to us, they, she was only, her and her sister were only there. We figured they were about three months old. Mm -hmm. They were so messy. I was constantly cleaning up poops and they just, you know, but once she got spayed, yeah. it was amazing the difference that made, plus maturity too, because she's a young rabbit and young ah. rabbits are like teenagers. Yeah. <laughs> so she can focus so. on other stuff when she exactly. wants her freedom. Hormones okay. do. Crazy stuff, yes. right? Yeah. Yes. They yeah, that's sure a whole other segment. Yes. Okay, so um, how can people learn more about bunnies? Do you, because you've got events coming up, do they get to meet bunnies, spend time with the bunnies? Um, yes, well, actually, we have, um, today actually is our bu annual bunny day at Hawes. Okay. We, it's an educational event. We have um, vet speakers that come. Um, we sell lots of bunny items. We talk to people about rabbits. You can talk to us about any questions you have. Yeah. We have information, handouts and stuff that are available to people. We also have a website um, that has great rabbit care information on it. So anybody can go there and check out Bunny Basics. And I want to talk about happy hour because I was <laughs> at happy hour yes, last, I think it was last year yep. with my Remy, daughter. I want you to come out. And it too. was, yeah. <laughs> Remy. You maybe we'll give her to. some of the lettuce. Would yeah. she come if out of we, we maybe take the, Okay. We'll take her house away. Here's happy hour. Oh, oh, wait, go back to the video. Yeah. Go back to the happy hour video. <laughs> no? Okay. Uh, no. There's no, happy yeah, hour. It Check it oh. out. I, it was like blowing my mind because there were rabbits everywhere. <laughs> they multiply. The it's like bunny heaven. Yes, yeah. it is like bunny heaven. <laughs> yep. Happy hour is bunny heaven. Look at them all. That is really, really cute. <laughs> I know. Can bunnies be kept outside or inside? Um, Does it matter? No. Um, we want them kept inside, inside, just like dogs or cats. They're they're prey animals, and mm -hmm. um, they can get frightened easily. Mm. Weather conditions. Rabbits don't do well when it's really hot outside. Um, hey, they can, she comes. They can, um, they can become scared if there's some kind of an animal at their cage. Um, it's just plus they she tend to come. get ignored, and any animal that's kept outdoors she tends comes. to be ignored. So, um, but you don't really get to know them when you have a rabbit in the house. You really realize the personalities they have. Yeah. I mean, they're really sweet. They can be really bossy. They can be demanding, <laughs> and usually they get what they want. Okay. And usually and they they're need, the head of the household. They need a lot of exercise too. That's yes. important for people to know if they are thinking about a rabbit for a yes. pet. Yes, well, you cannot put them in. You cannot. Don't go back there, honey. You cannot um, put Show them in, 
in if you want to take some green. Oh yeah, maybe. I do. Um, <clears throat> you can't put them in a small cage. Yeah. They need space. Rabbits need space and they need freedom. Being a prey animal, when they're confined in a small, small space, they feel trapped. That oftentimes creates behavior issues as well. Like deep, If you ever defensive. read up, there's actually great articles online how rabbits are like men. It's actually, <laughs> I swear to God, it's actually really, really funny. Yes. They need all this freedom and space. They need to be played with. They need to be let out. Like it's and then fed. It's that very funny. Is, look, look it up online. You're I gonna you're gonna find that. it out. Yeah. Yep. Oh, you're a single lady here, at we'll home. Talk about that. You don't want to be with men, but you want something like them. Get a bunny. <laughs> Wisconsin House Rabbit Society. You can learn more. Bunny Day coming up today. It's from noon to four at Haws and Waukesha. I'm so not kidding. Now here's either. what I want to talk about. Happy hour. Happy hour. <laughs> Sunday, May 19th, from 1:30 to 2:30. If you've never been, it's fantastic. That also is at Haws. They're on Northview Road. They have a beautiful location there in Waukesha. <laughs> Um, you could go to Wisconsin, is that HRS? Yeah, for okay. yes. house.org. Oh, yeah, yeah, for House Rabbit Society. Okay, yep. awesome. Mm -hmm. Great to see you. Yeah, thank you, Rummy. <laughs> I have some lettuce here for you. <laughs> so they don't know Come us. on over. Come get it. Yeah. All right.